Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge for the 10th of February. Today we are stealing the three parts of the Borealis Averlint prototype as fast as possible. We are dying, which doesn't matter because we're going fast anyways. X Foundry, which uh, could potentially come into play. Um, yeah, coming with a one-use teleporter, that could definitely have an influence on some people's times today. So we'll see how that all works out. Um, we've got shotguns, guns, light reinforcements, and that is it. Acid trap is not likely to be useful. Okay, I'm gonna approach from this side, so I think I can do that a little bit better. Yeah, my, my docks have not been the greatest the past few days. I wonder what that is about them. Okay, let's, did I, let me check my, no, I don't have any of the auto key, auto hotkeys set up, so I'm not sure what it is. Could just be not being in the right mindset or something. I don't like that right there. I should be able to, I should be safe to do this though. Um, all right. So if I can get you to shoot that guard, then I think we're good. Ah. Well, there's no, oh wait, alarm response is reinforcements, but that's coming from right there. So that should not be a problem. No, oh, I was a bit worried there. Uh, let's check universal right real quick. Okay, it's to the right. Yeah, I need to. Uh, need to figure out when. Uh, when the doors open for you and when they stay closed. Uh, I'll let you shoot your friend. And then take care of you. Shoot, or not shoot you, whack you. And grab that. Hmm. There we go. Ooh. All right. Well, that speeds this up a lot. Let's grab these. Um, hmm. What am Okay. So, in my looking at the concussion hammer, I completely failed to see that I could just visit directly from here to here. Um, so that's a disadvantage that I have. 
but by going through this long way, I did get in a, a swapper, and why did that minimize? Uh, I got a swapper, which means I can do the second ship incredibly fast. And the extreme rangeness makes it really good for the third ship as well. So it's not all bad. Um, so let's swap. Let's see, this will overshoot me a little bit. If I get it on the first try, then I'll do it. Or the second try. Alright, I'll just walk. Do you have a shotgun? You have a shotgun. Go ahead and shoot. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Some sort of beam, I think. Or a shield. Yeah, a shield works fine right here. So, let's hit. Start walking down. Launched out, go out, and jet off. So yeah, that could have been done quite a bit faster, but my mistake may have ended up benefiting me. For future ships, except for that clause penalty. Ooh, that's rough. Well, all right. We'll we'll just have to see how it goes. Um, light reinforcements. Oh wait, I can't swap in. I can't swap in because we're stealing. But I can still use the swapper to get really far. Okay, similar setup to the last one. So yeah, this is a similar case as the last one. Um, is there anything I can do with the swapper to get... Mmm, so if I if I visit here, grab that swap, and then I can get that crate as well. Um, I don't think I need guns. So I'll leave a couple of these here. All right. Um, I don't want to use that again because then returning will put me there. I should have used the hammer here. We've got a gun. And we'll swap, unlock, see if we can't do this, there we go. Another concussion hammer, okay. Not the greatest, but not useless. Okay. 
and you're both right there so and I've got the prototype all right turn to pod and go straight back ah 10 seconds Okay, so we've got shields everywhere. Luckily, no shotguns. Heavy reinforcements, tracker, jammer, many sentry guns, lots of guards. All right. So our target is up here. So which one would be better, going through here and using the swapper immediately? I think I'll try out this one. It's a bit risky because all of these ports are here. Or windows. There we go. Okay. So with a swapper, I can immediately get to you, grab the key. Get up here. And then I could visit in here, then go out the window. Okay, uh, I don't have a way to get, oh no, I do have a way to get your item, and that involves swapping with you. So I will swap, bash, steal, ooh, I've got another swap charge. Um... Let's see if I can't do this. Eh. Okay, so remote control. Redock. Key cloner. Now, I just... A random thought I just had. If the... Going through walls bug wasn't patched. Would we be able to do it uh, using this without any target? And then walls would just mean nothing if you have a melee weapon. That would be kind of funny. Okay, so if I... So if I visit up here, I could swap right here, but I don't have a way to get it all the way up there from there, so I can't do that yet. And I'm not gonna keep that in my action range because accidentally clicking on that is real annoying. Because of the error, it, the wide range of impact it has. like to do this please there we go I guess that works
Yeah. Hmm. Wait, what's that? Oh, you're pointing at each other. Okay. Um, I could get to you. I don't need your key because I can steal that one. Though I could take a risk and swap here and hope that I get lucky and again get another swapper charge. But once I'm right here, that's... Uh, there's only one gun. But I would have to dodge you. I think I can make that work. Uh, just in case, I'll take this with me. Swap. Steal. Let's bash. Deactivate. Shoot you. Oh, that missed. Oh, dear. That's, uh... Hmm. I don't know if I can dodge that. So, I can visit. But without getting to there, that means nothing. I think I'd prefer to visit out into space. Do I take the risk of getting shot here? You know, even if it misses me, there's a decent chance it bounces off this shield. I think it can do that twice. So it looks like we're going here. And we're just going to try and get to the cargo crate. Alright, sadly no extra charge. Okay, I did get that. Come on, come on. Now I guess I can do this now. Okay. Deactivate. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's hope it's a visitor. Uh, I think that's a slipstream. Uh, slipstream is good for us. Would it be better if it was a slipstream to try and make it out here or to just wait for the return and go to the telepad? Uh, let's see what it is. 
Okay, it's a beam. So, while I wait, I'm gonna get this to not do that. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, let's... Let's see what we've got here. Uh, you're... Alright, so you're crashed. You're crashed. Ooh, I did two crashes without any time moving forward. And a concussion hammer. And a another concussion hammer? No, that did a little bit time forward, at least. And I'm pretty sure this said it was rechargeable. Alright. So I actually need you to be part, yeah, so that I can, uh, okay. Whew, all right. Yeah, pretty lucky there, uh, having a crash beam. And a large use one at that. Alright, so got minus five on each of them. Uh, yeah, with a fast enough dock, I do think it was possible. Hmm. So it was, if you did a four second dock. Two seconds, visitor, and then a three t second return. It is possible to do, to have gotten the first two ships in under, in under 10 seconds. So with that alone, uh, someone else could beat me. But the swapper ended up being very useful in the final mission especially and also having those two concussion hammers did help a little bit so yes we'll see how this stands uh, if someone does a good dock and remembers to use a decent strategy for the visitor on the first two ships then they could take that um as for Yesterday, let's uh, the game crashed completely. Just waiting for it, waiting for it to sink. All right. Yesterday. All right, Renico held on to first. Uh, looks like Kesa didn't play, or was too late to get a score in or something. But yeah, good job, Renico. 25 seconds, just as Sebastian Crab kind of predicted. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. Anyways, that is all for today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.